Good morning, YouTube. As you know, today, Joe Biden is being inaugurated as the 46th president of the United States. Did I want that? No. Am I going to go out and raise Cain and protest all over town? No. It is what it is. Um, he was elected by whatever means it took, and he's now the 46th president of the United States. But one thing that I want to point out is we had all this these news reports from the media that there were going to be armed protests and riots in every state capital uh, yesterday or today. And I want to point out that I have been monitoring the news all morning, monitored it all the yesterday, and not one report came out of any type of demonstration, protest, riot, anything at any location in the United States. There may have been some, but none to the um, magnitude that required reporting from the news. So that's my point, is the mainstream media has come out and issued all these scare stories to get everybody worked up and riled up and upset. And at the end of the day, it turned out to be nothing. You have to ask yourself, what else is there that the news media has put out there that is just an inflammatory fake story? Um, I'm not calling for riots. I'm not calling for protests. You know, I think we just need to let today go and get it done peacefully and let the next four years quickly pass with no major uprisings so we can get somebody back in there who, who truly honestly has the country at heart. Um, and instead of themselves and their personal projects, but that's another video altogether. Um, but all I'm saying is when you watch the mainstream media and the stories they put out about major happenings across the country, especially ones that are supposed to be happening, use a, use a grain of caution with it. Use your, use your head and some common sense and look into stuff yourself. Um, had those protests gone off every state capital across the nation like they promised, I, I had already seen numerous references to where no right-wing groups were sponsoring any type of gatherings or protests or demonstrations. It was a false flag by other entities to make the right-wing entities look bad. Um, so please, if, if you're going to watch the news and whatnot, use a grain of common sense, do your own research, you know, as Ronald Reagan used to say, trust but verify. You know, I'm not saying don't watch the news, I'm not saying don't trust everything that, and don't believe everything they come out with, but listen to it, and then do your own research, and you'll probably find out that a lot of the stuff that they report isn't a quarter as scary as they're making it out to sound. Have a great day. God bless the USA. Come on 2024.